all right ladies and gentlemen in today's video we have multiple champion player pigeon r6 in the building here he's going to be trying to 1v9 nine plat players we're on tactical realism right now four of his teammates are going to run out of the building in the prep phase and we're going to give pigeon 30 extra seconds to set up and then everybody is going to rush in and try to take pigeon out there is one catch here though it's not going to be just a normal 1v9 no all of the plat players are going to be on one life pigeon however is going to have infinite lives so all pigeon needs to do is kill nine plat players and he wins map number one we're going to do a best of three so make sure you guys follow pigeon his socials are going to be linked down below in the description let's straight hop straight in round number one all right the round is about to start here it starts at 2 30 officially and pigeon is going to be getting ready inside of the closet right now he's going to be just playing here all of the plat players right now are currently droning trying to figure out exactly where pigeon is you see we've got the defenders and the attackers working together to take him down here two minutes 15 seconds on the clock so the round has officially started and right now jay seems to be the only one really actually trying to win he's droning out the map he's trying to find where pigeon is and finally he will find him tucked in the corner but oh no there goes uh oryx running straight into the building he's gonna get taken out but Chaos will take Pigeon out, and that is round number one over. All right, so with that, Pigeon is going to lose round number one, but it's really not that big of a deal. We're on Pro League settings right now. Pigeon has nine rounds to kill nine Platinums. It's very possible. So we're going to see what he can do here. All right, how are you feeling after round number one? You've already got one less to take out. Yeah, you got to just kill like a few of them. On me? Yeah, they can plant oh god okay yeah you have nine yeah, rounds to take out nine players so they have oh, yeah. like that's, that's gonna be easy that's gonna yeah be easy. so they they have like all the advantages otherwise well if they play coordinated it'll be impossible for me but I yeah can't imagine them doing that no 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 not with how they played last round exactly they're just gonna keep rushing at you until there's like five of them and then they're gonna be like wait a minute we're about to lose I don't know if I should. I think on the early rounds, I should just play for picks and like try and like, I don't know, like go where they're going to rush from and then try and get a few picks. And then late rounds, I'll play for plan. Yeah. All right. You can see the defenders are going to run outside of the building and meet up with all of the attackers. And they're going to give Pigeon another 20 seconds here. Set up the site and prepare for this push. There's only eight players now still going to be a challenge and like pigeon said if they play very coordinated and together it's going to be pretty much impossible to beat eight players here but if they continue to play solo pigeon might have some rounds here you can see that the round has officially started so all of our players are now running into the building trying to find pigeon and the first player to find him is going to be this mozzie but he's not going to take any damage instead actually lighting up pigeon just a little bit c4 is going out trying to take out pigeon but that is going to miss and now all of our plats are converging on the site they realize it's clear they're just trying to take site and plant two minutes left pigeon's gonna pop this hatch to try to walk down and take freezer back but jay's gonna team kill on accident so now there's only seven players left that player is gonna go ahead and leave now very good frag for pigeon here the team kills do count towards this round now pigeon's gonna walk down the main stairs as jay is finishing down the plant and there goes chaos six players remaining for the plats pigeon is making great work of these plat players but jackal trying to stop him from pushing in a quick peek battle is commencing with 30 seconds left on the diffuser pigeon's gonna have to need to push in quickly here another team kill jay team kills evident and evident is going to have to leave the game now unfortunate pre-fire coming out from the lion now pigeon on about 20 hp trying to run into the closet no rotates and lion's gonna be there to shut him down bro these guys are actually working against you right now or for you i mean actually working for you with all the team kills so in two rounds now you've gotten it from a 1v9 to only a 1v5 and you have no more people on your team anymore so that's great That'll be easy. I like my brain gets confused Defender when I start team killing because it'll say like team damage. Yeah. 
So getting rid of them is good. Yes, sir. Only five left. You got it. By the way, if you guys would like to play in any of these videos, consider joining my Discord server. It's completely free. The link is going to be down below in the description. If you ever want to play in any of these videos, I just add my Discord server and anybody is welcome to play. So long as you're on PC and you are the rank that I need for the video. All right, round number three is underway in five seconds. All of our plat players are going to push into the building. Yes. Pigeon inside of kitchen right now. Opting to go for the dining bomb site. We're going to see how he holds this as it looks like all five of our plat players are going to be pushing outside of small tower and we're going to get a bug and completely miss this whole round, of course. Gotta love Ubisoft. Good game, good game. Finally, we're back and now our plat players are going to be pushing into small tower pigeon inside of dining head glitching on this table right now it's actually a pretty good position but he's going to rotate off because he hears jay pushing through this green hall window and he can't let any solo players get behind him monty is now pushing up inside of the bomb site this is going to be really hard for pigeon now with constant spots being put onto his location and being pushed back into a corner Ooh, one player goes down. A great kill, and Pigeon's actually going to down another, but Jay comes up from behind, and unfortunately for Pigeon, that Grim is not quite going to be taken out fully, only downed, so he's going to stay in the game, but Pigeon does make it a 1v4. Now, he hasn't won any rounds yet, but as every round goes on and he grabs these kills, it's going to become more and more easy for him to win this, and now only four remaining players. We'll see if Pigeon's able to take them out. Good stuff, good stuff. Almost had that Grim. That would have been they're, huge. They're playing to win now. Yeah, they're playing also. shields. It's That's okay. I got a, I got on the Oryx. I'll counter them. W, W Oryx plays. Wait, I gotta hide. So I don't know who I am. You have an extra 30 seconds. Unless you want me to take it away. Uh, you can take it away. All right, so the round has started here and Pigeon is going to be inside a blue bunker. Now, he doesn't have a rotate out, but he is Oryx, so he'll be able to dash through this soft wall behind him and get back to site very quickly. And looks like he might have to do that now as he's getting droned out. So he's going to make that rotate just so he's able to fall back. Jay pushing upstairs, trying to take the tower stairs. You can see that all the plats are really pushing from a few different locations, and that's going to make it really difficult for Pigeon as he has to watch multiple different angles. Taking a look at the plats, looks like Rami is droning in through the backside while Jay has actually rotated from Big Tower and is alt walking into sight from Laundry. And Pigeon, all the way in the back of the stairs, will have no way of knowing. Jay also has the bomb, so he's going to start planning. All of these plat players are just sitting here as a distraction. The bomb goes down, 40 seconds left for Pigeon to get that defuse off. Drones are going to get shot out here as he goes for the swing, but Pigeon will miss the gunfight and Grug will take him out. Four rounds for the plat players now. And no kill that round for Pigeon, so the next round is also going to be a 1v4. So the settings might be uh, slightly messed up. All right, I can hear that Pigeon is getting hyped up for this round here, but it's going to be a struggle to win this now. He's on match point and... Well, the Plats are playing a lot more together than they were the first few rounds, and that's because they don't have nearly as many players. Pigeon was able to take out most of them, leaving only the four left, but they're going to be aggressively pushing in. We can see that Jay is already on the backside with the shield, but it looks like he's going to rotate, actually. Maybe try to push with the other Jay, who is Dokubi, droning out the front side right now. Pigeon trying to use the Solus gadget to figure out where these attackers are so far he's not going to spot anybody but he will spot out the drone from jay forcing him to push towards the building now Bashi in hand as well it's going to be interesting to watch grug and rami pushing through the back tower right now and oh here we go pigeon looking to get a kill but it is going to be on blitz he's going to have to run away now fortunately he does know the map very well he'll be able to run back down the stairs even while blinded and jay not being able to pull through with any damage there. The Dokubi calls are going to come out. Now, other J with the Bashi pushing down the laundry stairs, trying to find these kills. Blitz with the Diffuser here. Going to be pushing through Freezer. He could try to go for a plant, but Pigeon's going to be inside of Supply. 
on this single wall just waiting he knows that the blitz is here now but won't really be able to do much damage unfortunately player on the back stairs and pigeon looks away at the wrong time the nade comes out lots of damage on a pigeon but a kill on the j before he gets instantly refragged and Grug will take him out. GG on map number one. Pigeon was able to bring the plats from nine to only three. But unfortunately, he was not able to win on map number one. We're gonna head to map number two. All right, ladies and gentlemen, here we go with map number two. Pigeon has chosen border. And we're gonna have the round start in the next 10 seconds here. Gonna give Pigeon a little bit of extra time to set up and defend the site. All right, you can see that the other defenders, the other plat players are outside and everybody is going to be making their way towards the building now, hoping to find Pigeon. Now, remember, all deaths are a death. So if anybody team kills or anything like that, they will be instantly taken out. Taking a look at a zombie. They're going to be pushing in through armory right now. They're trying to find where Pigeon is, but he's being sneaky right now, currently in the back of armory and he just got droned out. But unfortunately for him, the plants are going to start planting. Monty trying to get that plant down. DK throwing some shots off through the wall. But oh no, a team kill coming out on the concept. And that is going to be round over. But with one death on the side of the plat. So the next round, we will be starting as a 1v8. Oh no, Pigeon's gonna fall off while trying to get into that boost spot. And he's gonna put in chat that he's trolling. Trolling indeed is he's gonna be put on to below half HP. We're gonna give Pigeon another couple seconds here before all of these players start to rush in and try to take him out. Pigeon on below half HP, gonna be sitting in archives right now. Just trying to stay alive, honestly. Seeing if he can't sneakily take down one or two players. These first few rounds, no one's really expecting him to win, but we are expecting him to grab a couple kills and make the next rounds easier for him. Two minutes left, so plenty of time for our plat players and Pigeon. Still holding strong here. Just waiting for any players to come in, and there's the Monty. That player goes down one less for the plats. Jay's gonna go ahead and leave the game and now Pigeon is going to be taken out by a C4. Unfortunate. So now round number two goes to the plats as well, but Pigeon will have taken down that Monty. So the next round, there will only be six players or seven players. Bro, Legion is a crazy pick. Yo, Legion's a crazy pick when half the players in the lobby are on your team. No, 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 no. It's great. It's fine. <laughs> okay, the man. The reason behind it was I they expect me to be on Vigil. So I'm going to, like, jump out. And I'm going to, like, flank them at 2.30. Okay. Good luck. Because they all go on the balcony here. Mm-hmm. Like, well, Pigeon is trying to set up some sort of a play on the east stairs side right now but unfortunately for him most of the plat players are all going to be on the other side of the map by the north c4s are going out and missing from mute as jay's going to drone up the site try to figure out where pigeon is hiding at now pigeon needs to be a little bit careful here as if he does not make it back to site soon, Leo is going to be able to plant. And I don't think anybody even realizes Pigeon's actually outside. No, they will. Valkyrie will realize Pigeon goes down and round number three goes to the plats. All right, here we go with round number four. Pigeon is still going to be against a lot of plats, seven of them to be exact. And we're going to see if he's able to take a few of them out. Hopefully before he gets put onto match point, but we can see Jay always with the drones has got a drone in sight and he's going to be calling out exactly where Pigeon is playing. Now, Pigeon is playing on Legion, but because of how we had to set this round up, a lot of the players in the lobby are actually on his team, but it doesn't even look like these players know who they're fighting. They're fighting the wrong players and well, my editor is going to take out a zombie and he goes, wait, he doesn't even realize he's in a gunfight with the wrong person. And he's going to have to leave now one less player for Pigeon to fight against. And he's going to grab another kill as well onto DK. So no more Echo. Two big kills here on the round for Pigeon so far. 
two minutes left on the clock and he's going to be making his way into the 90 hall trying to find another player and he's going to leo goes down and oh here we go pigeon is cooking up only four more players for pigeon to take out impacting the east door he's gonna run out but no players are there does he know the warden is sitting there he doesn't and evident with the weird positioning on east stairs will finish pigeon off and that's gonna be round number four going to the plat players but not without some big kills for pigeon all right we're on to round number five here we're gonna give pigeon a couple extra seconds to set up as usual but with only four players for pigeon to take out this round's going to be very possible he's got lesion the secondary super shorty is going to help him set up the site a little bit along with those impact grenades and now we're going to start the round here allow all of our plat players to push in rami doing some good drone work right there now pigeon close to the door with the super shorty it's going to be waiting for these plat players to push in jay is going to be droning with bravo potentially able to hack some of those lesion mines Pigeon's going to go ahead and drop, get away from Armory now as the rest of our plot players are trying to find exactly where he is. Warden going to be pushing in towards offices, shooting in towards archives, thinking that Pigeon might be on site. But instead, he's going to be in the 90 hall right now, trying to find a kill on one of these players on the east side of the map he's gonna see rami droning outside break room he's gonna push up and that's gonna be a free kill for pigeon he needs to kill the last remaining three players though if he wants to win this game evidence going to oryx up through the hatch and pigeon's gonna swing that and boom easy kill for pigeon 1v2 now as he's trying to find the last few remaining players warden's gonna be inside of archives holding down the site Jay right now, still on his drone, just trying to figure out where Pigeon went. He's got time to drone. But with only a minute and 10 seconds left, they're going to need to be quick. Legion Mines are going out onto the Diffuser, and since Warden is on defense, he will not be able to plant. So really, Jay is potentially the last hope for the plant here, as he's going to be droning Pigeon out still in this break door. Warden going to be pushing up towards office, trying to grab an angle on the pigeon, but he's going to be firmly inside of security, holding this down. Melee hole comes out. Warden will notice that, but won't be able to get the kill. And oh, there it is. Warden will take pigeon out, and that's going to be GG. The plats are going to take it 2-0. But let's give some big props to pigeon. He made it pretty far. He was able to bring it down to 1v2 from a 1v9. So make sure you guys subscribe to him. I'll have his channel linked down below in the description. Make sure you guys are subbed to my channel as well. If you guys haven't already, make sure to like the video. Comment down below if you guys want to see any other video ideas. And remember to join my Discord if you want to play in the next video. But I'll see you guys later. GG's. Oh, I thought I had another round. Damn. Yeah, you almost had it.